If you're not stressed before watching Understanding Stresses and Strains, the thought of having a peptic ulcer as a result of stress may well start to make you stressed. This is a Disney educational short from 1968 and I have to say it's pretty good. It really is. There are bits that are cheesy but it's one of those educational shorts and it's not always the case with Disney that's still relevant today. And it basically looks at what happens to the body when you're stressed, what the fight or flight response is, and ultimately gives the message that you don't need to stress about things because your stresses will be resolved, which I think is a very naive way of looking at things. But when it says, hey, if you're stressed, it might cause a peptic ulcer, I think the intention was for somebody to look at it and start deep breathing and go, you know what, I don't need to be stressed. But for me, and I assume for other people, I went great so it's not enough that I'm stressed it might give me an ulcer which I mean I knew anyway uh, stress is a cause of various health complaints but I will say it is actually very well put together it starts off with a pretty catchy rather upbeat song and then surprisingly we have some live action footage of animals um some deer I think big cats it's quite brief but it was a uh, really unexpected and quite nice to look at and about survival and then we get a bit of the anatomy and what various parts of the body do that are relevant to stress and strains and then the bulk of this I'd say pretty much all of the second half talks about what happens to the body when you're stressed when the well when there's a perceived threat or fear whether it's real or not um, when your body perceives this fear what happens and what the fight or flight is um I, I guess by today this would have been the fight fight I don't know why I'm having difficulty getting my mouth around this sentence today this would be about the fight flight or freeze response there we go but it doesn't feel that dated otherwise everything still seems like it's the same as education today so uh yeah if you're new to this kind of actually I was gonna say if you're new to fight or flight and the body's physical response to emotional stress it would be a good introduction but at the same time maybe not because as soon as they started to talk about peptic ulcers and I just thought okay this is actually terrifying my stress is not enough let's make me more stressed so it may not be the best stress reliever you know power comes from knowledge and by knowing what happens with your body when you're stressed it can help you to manage those feelings because a lot of stress is actually a biological response and it is you know it's really fascinating but I, it's something I've you know looked into quite a lot over the years with various therapies and things but aside from it being a physical response <laughs> I feel like it, the episode could have done well with some actual stress relieving techniques because it's all well and good knowing why the body is responding in a certain way and it's all well and good knowing that if you don't take steps to reduce stress you're going to get an ulcer obviously not guaranteed thankfully but at the end of the day what use is any of that without methods of relieving stress it's kind of like saying here you're stressed don't be stressed because it might kill you goodbye <laughs> that's basically what it does um it's all well having disney telling you that actually calm down your stresses are probably just perceived fears and problems have a way of working themselves out it's nice to be reminded of that and to allow us a moment to take you know to take stock of things and to see if we are actually stressed about something that's worth stressing about because thankfully more often than not that's not the case i think we all are very good at sweating the small stuff but yeah i feel like unless there's like a, a part two that's about relieving stress i haven't looked at that but certainly if there is it shouldn't be separate because it's, it's informative but not very helpful but i enjoyed it i thought it was well animated the live action elements i hadn't expected so it was pretty creative pretty well put together uh yeah i'd recommend watching it but maybe bookmark some kind of stress relief guide or you know write down the things that you do that relieve stress beforehand because yeah it, it definitely made me feel more stressed than anything else but other than that it's educational it's still pretty relevant today very well animated clearly narrated no problems at all uh definitely something that i'd, I'd well I'd, I'd probably watch again directed by the brilliant hamilton luske and yeah it's the quality we can expect from disney's educational shorts at this time 
not that cheesy, still pretty informative, well animated, might raise your blood pressure, but otherwise pretty decent.